Hey guys, welcome to another Transfer Tuesday video on Budget with a July Dreamer. My name is Miranda and on this channel I share everything personal finance. I cover budgeting, saving and investing. If these topics are of interest to you then please hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into today's video. So if you're new around this part and are not familiar with what Transfer Tuesday is, Transfer Tuesday is a money movement that was started by Mary. She's here on YouTube at Pen Is Not Perfection with the idea being that we look for money within our budgets and send that towards our financial goals. So she started this when she was paying off her, her student debt, I believe. And a lot of us here in the finance community have taken that same principle on board. And every single Tuesday, we come here, share with you what we're doing with our money, mostly for accountability purposes. So for me, for Transfer Tuesdays for the month of January, I did say that I'm focusing on saving for the holidays that I have in the month of January. I actually made a very shocking decision the other day where I was like, okay, I think for February, I probably won't travel abroad. And I'm just like, I don't know how I feel about that, but you know what, you know, it's for, for a good reason. But in any case, I do have a trip this week and I also have a trip at the end of the month. So I'm focusing on saving for that. So I will put up a screenshot of the budget that I have for this trip and yes it is a budget channel so um finance channel so I always do a budget I love budgeting for all my trips for everything that I do in my life so I did a budget for the upcoming trip and I shared with you I think in the first transfer Tuesday for the month of January that I had saved 90 pounds towards the hotel I think the hotel is between 85 86 pounds between 80 and 85 pounds I think for the entirety of our stay but I saved 90 pounds to account for um city tax and stuff like that just for any additional charges so 90 pounds is what I saved then what I also did I believe last week I also saved about 15 pounds or 20 pounds 15 pounds I think that I saved for miscellaneous and this is quite unusual because normally I would save for everything else before I save for miscellaneous but I have 15 pounds and in my budget for the trip I had put that 15 pounds for miscellaneous so I'm like okay miscellaneous has been saved for so today whilst I'm not going to do a live transfer I am going to move 50 pounds towards my savings for the trip because 50 pounds is how much I've budgeted for the fuel that I'll need in my car. So between now and when I go, I will probably use about 10 miles worth of fuel because it's just um, going to the gym and back and maybe to the shops to get last minute um, items. But other than that, I'm not planning to do any long distance travel. So I still have about over a hundred miles uh, in the tank right now so 50 pounds should be enough so I think about 60 miles I'll need just to go and then coming back I'll fill up uh, with the 50 pounds and even though it won't be a full tank it will be enough to get me back home and use it for a couple more days so that's the next thing so that then leaves me with uh, food and activities now these are the two things that I'm going to cash flow now I say cash flow loosely because even though I'm just going to be using my credit card and tapping away in the back of my mind there is already about 300 pounds or thereabouts that's already allocated for food and for um activities I just don't know if we're going to be doing a lot of activities because I just looked at the the weather report and it might be snowing um so we will definitely we're definitely um going in Europe Yep, my trip this week is in Europe. So I think we'll be doing a lot of indoor stuff like the museums and stuff like that. So I don't know yet if we'll be doing a lot of activities, but we shall see. We're still working out all the kinks of our trip. But that is it for the, I think it's the third Transfer Tuesday for the month of January 2023. Again, I'm not going to be talking about my 100 Envelope Savings Challenge this week because I'm just trying to focus on funding this trip. Obviously, the money that I'm saving on my 100 Envelope Savings Challenge is one that I'm using for my trips, but I would like to use it for the trips at the end of this month and trips in the future as well. So, 
that is it for the third transfer tuesday for january 2023 i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you in my next video bye